You play ball like a girl! How did you choose your college? I think that's a big decision, obviously, that you know high school athletes have to face. Um, well, all high school students, but especially for athletes just figuring out whether or not they want to play in school. Um, so how did you choose Point Loma as your school? Yeah, so at that point, I wasn't really interested in like competing athletically in college. And so it was kind of once I was at Point Loma and they offered the walk-on, I was like, well, I might as well give it a shot. But it didn't play a big role in my decision. My dad was actually a counselor at Point Loma. And so I had um, the chance to have a very nice break on tuition. Mm -hmm. And so in addition to that, they had a great broadcast journalism team mm -hmm. or program. And so yes. I ended up going, that was what really led into it was I didn't really want to leave the beach. Mm -hmm. um, I wasn't like, the, really the only hangout for Point Loma was that um, they didn't have a football team. And I uh. loved football and I wanted to be a sideline reporter for football. And so mm -hmm. how on earth can you do that if you don't have a football team in college? But I met with the head of the journalism department and he was like, well, we don't have a team, but SDSU has one and the Chargers were there at the time. And so, um, you know, he was like, we can get you internships covering football. And so he kind of convinced me like, that's not as big of a deal as you might think it is. Right. Uh, so that's how I ended up choosing Point Loma. Yeah, that's amazing. Well, I mean, it's Point Loma. I don't know <laughs> if the listeners haven't seen the campus, it is freaking beautiful yeah. like heaven on earth if you talk about maybe one of the prettiest campuses ever um yeah but <laughs> google but, the baseball field that's oh, yeah or the track either of those if they don't convince oh you that it's gorgeous i don't know what to tell you right you're crazy <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs>